Hey everybody, Brandon Villarolo here for Tech Republic, and today I want to cover how to create uh, and modify tags in Microsoft Teams. So what is a tag in Teams? Uh, specifically, tags refers to a way to basically create little subgroups uh, for notification and chat uh, inside of a team. So you could say tag, you know, a team supervisor and their subordinates, or you know, everyone in HR or, uh, you know, people who are working together on a single project. So you can create those tags and then by simply using an at uh, in a conversation down here, you can send a message directly to all the members of a tag. So to create a tag, it's simple enough. While you're in the uh, Teams screen here, look for these three little dots on the right hand side of the team name. Click on those dots and you'll see manage tags down here. So click on that. And if you don't have any tags yet, you'll see this. If there are tags in the team, you'll see whichever ones are created uh, as sitting there. Click Create Tag. Let's create this one. Let's call it Big Project. Now, you cannot save a tag until you actually add people to it. You can see Create down here is grayed out. So I'll add myself. And now, and I've noticed something when doing this, is that I have a separate or a second account under my name on here on this dummy team that I should be able to add if I just start typing my own name in. Uh, but for some reason, it doesn't come up, even though I am a member of this team. So I'll get rid of that and I'll show you how to alternatively add people to a tag um, in another area. So I've created the tag, I've added myself, so right now I'm the only member of this tag. So I hit create and you can see now all the tags uh, in this particular team and the tags that you particularly are a part of. I'll close this out and if you want to add people to a tag after you've already created it and it's not letting you find that person in that in that menu, you can go over here to manage team, click on that, and you'll see all the members of this particular team. And if I expand this, I can see that I'm I, the other account is here as well. So it's down there as a member of the team. Um, and you can see right here to the right, there's an area for all the tags that, that person is part of. And if you mouse over it, the little tag icon will appear. Click on that. And you can see all you have to do to add someone to the tag is to check their name there and hit apply. So now both me and my other account are members uh, on this big big project tag. So I'm going to go back over here and show you how to use those tags. So now in the general screen for the uh, you know the posts for the team, if you go over here and you type an at sign, you can see it comes up with the name there. And if I start typing big, you'll see the tag comes up big project. So I click on that, and now I'm typing only to people in the bro the big project tag. So don't forget about that deadline. And then you can see here, it shows you in red that it's from that particular team, and also that the at sign is there indicating that you're a part of that team. Now lastly, if it, you're done using a tag and you want to remove people from it, you can go over to Manage Tags, and you can click there, and you can remove a person from a tag. And then you can remove a person, you can remove everybody, and then once you're done removing everybody, the tag gets deleted. There's no way to actually just go in and delete a tag wholesale. You've got to actually remove all the members from it, as far as I can tell. I've looked other ways to delete a whole tag, but uh, for some reason it can't seem to, to just give you a click delete option. You've got to remove people one by one. Um, you can also do this. Let's recreate this tag project and add myself again. Create that tag. Now you see that tag exists. Uh, the other area I showed you to add people and see all the members of the team, if you go to manage team again and you come over here and look at the members. So you can see here I'm tagged as being part of project. If I go over here, click on this and deselect myself and apply, then I'm not a member of that tag anymore. And if I go over here to manage tags, you'll see that tag has been deleted as well. So it's not the most direct uh, way to manage tags uh, in terms of deletion, but that's what you got to do uh, in, in Teams as far as I can tell. All right, that's it for tags. Uh, hopefully these will be useful to you in your organization. For Tech Republic, I'm Brandon Villarolo. Be sure to stay tuned for more tips and tricks just like this one.